The Frisco Rough Riders are back at Dr. Pepper Ballpark to open up an eight-game homestand, and we're honored to be joined on the Rough Riders pregame show today by Texas Rangers rehabber Tanner Shepers. Tanner, we really appreciate the time. Of course, uh, elbow inflammation was the listed in injury that put you on the disabled list back in April. And simple question, I'm sure you've been asked it a lot lately, but uh, how does the elbow feel? A lot better, you know, getting the body back. To, you know, playing every day, um, getting ready every day. Uh, you know, I'm just kind of excited to be able to pitch in a ball game again. Um, you know, I'm interested to get back out there and compete and help out the team um, and get some W's. Were you physically able to see uh, the inflammation on that right elbow, or was it something that the doctors looked at and told you this is what you have? It was, um, you know, my my flexor tendon. Um, I strained that, and uh, it showed that through the MRI. Um, it was pretty uh, irritated through the MRI which uh, irritated me is basically inflammation. And um, that's where the pain was coming from. And it was just something that needed some time to, you know, calm down and, you know, reassess and start program up again. Your pro career got off to a bit of a slow start because of injuries. You had a great 2013 season. Might have seemed like you'd finally cleared the injury hurdle, but uh, what were your thoughts when you caught the injury bug this year again? Uh, definitely frustrating, um, but you know, something that's kind of part of the game. I mean, you look around the ball game and you see a lot of guys go down, um, you know, for a little bit of time, you know, either correct a little something. Um, and it's kind of just the nature of the ball game. You know, we play 162 games, so it's pretty taxing on your body. Um, so it's kind of just part of it. It's my, my first time on the big league deal. So it's, I guess, a little bit of mental grind, and you know, I just kind of want to get back as soon as possible. We're with Rangers reliever Tanner Shepers on the Rough Riders pregame show. And Tanner, I mentioned your 2013 season, uh, 27 holds. That tied a Rangers record for most holds in a season. Also, 76 appearances. That was the most by a right-hand pitcher in Rangers history. Uh, do you think overuse of your arm may have played a role in, in your injury? Um, you know, I don't think so. You know, and, and some people will say, you know, was it because you're starting pitching? And I don't think that's the case either. You know, I think it's just, you know, a combination of a lot of things. You know, sometimes the body's just not ready for something. And, uh, you know, I think that could have been the case. It could have been a blessing in disguise, you know, taking a couple weeks now instead of something more serious, um, which you've seen a lot of the guys go down this year with. Um, so, you know, it, it could be just a blessing in disguise, you know, I and mean, I'm just kind of happy to be moving forward. Injuries have obviously been a huge part of the Rangers' season so far. Uh, there have been questions about what your role will be when you do, in fact, return to the lineup in Arlington. What do you think? Do you like the role of setup man? Would you prefer to be a starter? What are your thoughts on that? Um, you know, I've kind of let them know that, you know, long-term wise, I would always like the opportunity to start. Um, you know, they've kind of shut me down for that this year. Um, I think they're playing a little more caution route. Don't want to hurt my arm if starting was the issue. Um, but, you know, I'll be more than happy to go into the setup role again this year or just be in the bullpen. You know, really it's just about being in the big leagues and competing and, you know, helping a big league team win. Not every pitcher has the flexibility to go either way like that, like you do, either a bullpen guy or a, or a starter. What changes mentally, if any, are there between a starting pitcher and a reliever? You know, yeah, as a starter, you know, you got to be prepared, you know, to face the same guy four or five times. Um, you know, as a reliever, you're going to see him basically one time, and uh, you're going to go with your power stuff and not get beat by your secondary pitches and just kind of go after guys. And I think that's kind of the main difference. Um, you know, it's kind of just, you know, I'm going to come at you a little bit more as a reliever. Tonight, you're expected to go one inning. What are your goals for this rehab stint tonight? Do you want to K the side? Do you want to throw 20 pitches or less? Do you just want to get through the inning? You know, I just want to feel good. I think that's kind of the overall thing. Um, you know, I think guys that are rehab kind of always get mixed results. Um, but I think it's just kind of going out there and make sure you feel good, make sure the arm is in the right place, the mechanics are sound, and just go out there and repeat it every pitch. Rangers righty Tanner Shepard is with us on the Rough Riders pregame show. You spent some time in AAA in rehab as well. Five runs allowed over three and two-thirds innings pitched. Honestly, though, do you put any stock into the numbers in, on a rehab assignment, or are you just looking to feel good, as you said? You know, I think it's just about feeling good, you know. Um, you know, the results aren't pretty if you look at it all on paper, but I think if you're there watching the game, you'd just be like, well, you know, those are pretty good pitches, and they did a good job hitting it. Um, sometimes you guys got to tip your cap to some guys. You know, they know you're rehabbing, you know you're, you're trying to fill up the strike zone, so they're going to go out there and ambush you a little bit. Um, 
So I guess it's just about refocusing yourself and just kind of put, trying to put yourself in a situation that you would be in the big leagues. What do you think is separating you right now from getting back to the big league lineup in Arlington? Um, you know, I think it's just about getting some more innings under my belt. Um, you know, switching back to the reliever role, it's not the easiest thing to do. So there's a little transition mark there. And um, I think it's just about getting everything ready. Um, it makes, I think they just want to make sure that I am right and ready to go before they throw me into the fire. What is it about that transition that makes it difficult? Um, it's just different mindset and, um, you know, being able to recover day in and day out. Um, you know, being able to go back to back, being able to, uh, you know, you know, throw seven times in a matter of, you know, 10 days. So I think that's just kind of the main thing. So just kind of making sure and playing it safe and uh, make sure that I don't have any uh, mishaps. Of course, you played for the Rough Riders in parts of the 2010 and 2011 seasons. Do you have any memories, uh, particularly good ones, that stand out that you could share with us on the pregame show? You know, I don't have, like, one particular in-game experience. Um, I guess the one thing that always stuck, stuck in my mind, I balked against these guys to lose a game when I was closing, uh, I think in 2011. But other than that, it was just really just the guys in the clubhouse. You know, there's a lot of big league guys um, that are in the big leagues right now that were playing with me in those years. So it's kind of crazy to look at at that and see all the guys kind of spread around now. So certainly some added incentive now taking on the missions again tonight. You got to set the record straight against these guys and, and no box. Yeah. Um, you uh, played collegiately at Fresno State, had a very successful career there. Have you gotten the chance to talk to manager Jason Wood about uh, similar experiences? So he, of course, played at Fresno State as well. Yeah, he sure did. Um, he did a little bit before I did. <laughs> but um, no, no, we've we've always talked to it. We like Fresno. I know he lives uh, on Bakersfield full time, and um, I think we've still got a little bit of Bulldogs in us. Well, Tanner, it's been great to have you in Frisco for these past few uh, relief appearances, rehab appearances, and we're looking forward to seeing you back in in Rangers uniform sometime soon. Best of luck on your continued road to recovery, and thanks again for your time. Oh no, I really appreciate it. He's Tanner Shepherd joining us on the Rough Riders pregame show. Back in a moment on the Rough Riders Baseball Network.